In the vast blue depths of our planet's oceans, there exists a world of extraordinary creatures. Among them, the orca or the killer whale stands as a symbol of both beauty and power. The orca, a name that resonates with majesty and awe, roams the vast oceans from the icy Arctic to the temperate waters of the equator. These magnificent mammals are not just skilled predators, but also deeply social creatures. Their world is one of intricate relationships, complex communication, and cooperative hunting strategies that demonstrate remarkable intelligence. With their distinctive black and white coloring, orcas are easily recognizable. They are apex predators, much like the lions of the savanna, and their hunting techniques are as varied as they are ingenious, from synchronized attacks to stun their prey to the strategic use of waves to hunt seals. The orca's hunting prowess is unmatched in the marine world. But long before orcas dominated the oceans, there lurked a creature of such size and might that its very name evokes a sense of prehistoric terror, the megalodon. This colossal shark, now extinct, is believed to have reached lengths of up to 60 feet, dwarfing even the largest of modern great white sharks. Roaming the ancient seas, the megalodon was a true giant, an apex predator whose massive jaws and formidable teeth made it the master of its domain. Its diet likely consisted of large marine mammals and fish, anything that could satisfy its enormous appetite. The megalodon's reign in the ocean was one of undisputed dominance, a testament to the evolutionary marvels of the marine world. Today we marvel at the orca's intelligence and prowess, and we look back in awe at the might of the megalodon. As we delve deeper into their worlds, we find stories of survival, adaptation, and the relentless march of evolution. Join us as we explore the lives of these two incredible species, their legacies in the ocean's depths, and the fascinating question of what might happen in a hypothetical encounter between the ocean's most intelligent hunter and its largest predator. As we embark on a journey through time and water, let's delve into the remarkable physical attributes of these two marine titans. The orca, an agile and streamlined mammal, typically measures up to 26 feet in length. Despite being dwarfed by the colossal megalodon, orcas are remarkably strong for their size, equipped with powerful muscles and a hydrodynamic body shape ideal for swift and agile swimming. With teeth measuring up to four inches long, orcas are well equipped for capturing and tearing apart their prey, which ranges from fish to seals and even large whales. In contrast, the megalodon was a behemoth of the ancient seas. Estimates suggest this giant shark could have been up to 60 feet long with a jaw wide enough to swallow a car. Its teeth, some of the largest ever discovered, measured over seven inches, perfectly designed for grabbing and crushing its prey. The sheer size and power of the megalodon made it an unrivaled predator. Its robust body and tail provided the thrust needed to accelerate through the water, capturing large and robust prey such as prehistoric whales. While the megalodon relied on its size and brute force, the orca evolved different hunting adaptations. Their intelligence leads to complex social structures and collaborative hunting strategies. Orcas use echolocation for communication and hunting, allowing them to detect prey over vast distances from stunning fish with tail slaps to orchestrating coordinated attacks on larger prey, orcas have developed a diverse arsenal of tactics that rely on both physical prowess and mental acuity. The orca and the megalodon, though separated by millions of years, represent the pinnacle of aquatic adaptation and survival. One, a testament to the power of intelligence and social bonds. The other, a symbol of sheer prehistoric might. As we continue our journey, we find that these physical attributes are just the beginning of their incredible stories. In the vast tapestry of the ocean's life, behavior is as varied as the creatures themselves. The orca and the megalodon, though both apex predators, exhibit strikingly different social behaviors. Orcas are known for their complex social structures. 
They live in highly cohesive groups known as pods, which are often matriarchal and can include several generations of family members. Communication is key in their world, with a sophisticated language of clicks, whistles, and body language, fostering strong bonds and coordinated efforts. The Megalodon, on the other hand, is believed to have been a solitary hunter. Its sheer size and dietary needs likely made it difficult to sustain large groups. Thus, this prehistoric giant roamed the ancient seas alone, relying solely on its formidable size and strength to dominate the marine food chain. Orcas utilize a variety of hunting strategies tailored to their specific prey. Some pods specialize in hunting fish, while others have adapted to hunt marine mammals like seals or even larger whales. Their tactics can be incredibly sophisticated, involving coordination, communication, and even role specialization within the pod. The megalodon's hunting techniques, while not observed directly, can be inferred from its anatomy and the fossil record. This colossal predator likely used ambush tactics, using its speed and size to surprise its prey. Its powerful jaws and massive teeth were perfect for gripping and crushing large prey, suggesting a diet consisting of whales, large fish, and other marine mammals. The contrast in their hunting strategies highlights a fundamental difference in their approach to survival. The orca, with its reliance on group dynamics and diverse tactics, contrasts sharply with the megalodon's solitary and straightforward approach, yet both were perfectly adapted to their respective environments and periods in history. As we explore the depths of these magnificent creatures' behaviors, we uncover a fascinating reflection of the diversity of life in our oceans. The social bonds of the orca and the lone dominance of the megalodon remind us of the many paths evolution can take in the endless quest for survival. To truly understand the majesty of the megalodon, we must journey back in time, millions of years to a world vastly different from our own. The megalodon thrived during the Miocene and Pliocene epochs, approximately 23 to 3.6 million years ago. These were times when the oceans teemed with a diversity of life, including gigantic whales, large sea turtles, and various species of marine mammals and fish. These ancient waters, the megalodon was the undisputed ruler. Its size and predatory skills meant it likely had a little competition. This era was a golden age for marine megafauna and the megalodon sat at the apex of this underwater hierarchy. Our understanding of this prehistoric giant comes primarily from its fossilized teeth and vertebrae. The sheer size and serration patterns of these teeth provide insights into its enormous biting power and dietary habits. These fossils tell a story of a super predator capable of consuming large prey with ease. Bite marks found on whale bones suggest that megalodons hunted large marine mammals, using their massive jaws not just to kill, but also to dismember their prey for easier consumption. The question of the megalodon's extinction remains a topic of intense scientific interest. Theories range from climate change and declining food sources to competition with other large marine predators. As the world changed, the megalodon, once the ruler of the seas, vanished, leaving only fossilized remnants as a testament to its existence. Through these ancient relics, we glean a glimpse into a world long gone. The megalodon's legacy, written in stone and fossil, provides a stark contrast to the ongoing story of the orca, our modern oceanic marvel. As we delve deeper, we uncover more than just facts. We unearth stories of life, survival, and the ever-changing tapestry of our planet's history. Imagine, if you will, a scenario where time and reality converge, bringing together two of the ocean's most formidable predators, the orca and the megalodon. This theoretical encounter, while purely speculative, invites us to explore the strengths and weaknesses of these apex predators. The orca, agile and intelligent, is known for its strategic hunting techniques and social cooperation. In a confrontation, 
These attributes could provide a significant advantage. Orcas are used to hunting large prey and often use their environment to their benefit. Their ability to communicate and coordinate could turn a battle into a tactical exercise, using their numbers and cunning to outmaneuver a larger foe. On the other side, the Megalodon, an embodiment of brute strength and size, would rely on its sheer physical power. Its massive jaws and robust body are built for a solitary and decisive strike, capable of inflicting critical damage with a single bite. In a theoretical battle, the environmental setting plays a crucial role. In the deep, open waters, the Megalodon would have the advantage, using the depths to ambush and overpower its opponent with its size and strength. Conversely, in shallower waters or areas with complex geography, the Orcas's agility and ability to navigate tight spaces could turn the tide, allowing them to outflank and outmaneuver the larger shark water temperature and visibility are also vital factors. Orcas are known to thrive in a variety of climates, including icy waters, which might not be favorable for a warm water hunter like the Megalodon. While such a confrontation remains in the realm of imagination, it invites us to appreciate the diverse adaptations and survival strategies these creatures evolved. The Orca and the Megalodon, though separated by millions of years, both represent the pinnacle of adaptation and survival in the marine world.